right, good morning traders. This is your free daily video from SeasonalSwingTrader.com. Today is Tuesday, January 24th, 2017. And we're gonna look at a stock called Domino's Pizza, DPZ, it's DPZ, Domino's Pizza. And we're looking at a stock today that has displayed a 100% positive win rate over the last 10 years. So from January 24th to March 8th is the seasonal trade. Uh, entry is today, January 24th through March 8th. Keep in mind, we do have earnings around uh, late February, February 24th or 25th. But as you can see, that over the five and 10 year averages have been pretty consistent. Uh, most notably, uh, you can see the strength here post earnings. So always exercise caution uh, with these trades going into earnings. You can also see that we have a minor dip around the 14th or 15th of February, but an entry today uh, does provide some strength going in, um, into that dip. So if you were to get long, you may want to tighten up stops or even possibly exit uh, to see if we do pull back down. And then if we pull back down, it provides another opportunity to get into the upside. Also, would probably exit, especially depending on where we are in the trade. If we've got a lot of profits, uh, and you're trading multiple shares or multiple options, uh, you could maybe leave some possible runners on. But uh, if you are up on the trade or down, uh, or if we're near break even, probably exit before earnings, uh, just because this thing has had about a 10 to $14 average range on earnings. So we would want to step out of the way to avoid any gap possibilities. Once earnings shakes out, could provide a chance to get back in if we haven't already taken a good uh, bit of meat off the bone, but you can see that this does trade uh, higher into uh, March 8th. So let's take a look at the chart. We are open today. It's around uh, 8.45 a.m. Central, 9.45 Eastern. The market is open. S&P's slightly up about a point to unchanged. You can see uh, we opened up here on Domino's at 167.16, trading at 167.70. So uh, initial targets here, I like the 172 to 173 area. Uh, stops would go below here around the 160 level. I uh, drew a um, short-term Fibonacci uh, swing point from the swing high to the swing low here at uh, 153.58. You can see yesterday we bounced cleanly off of the 618. We're holding above the 9 and the 15 averages, uh, also trading above the 50 100A and of course the 200. Momentum indicators pointing up. Uh, do like this trade again. There, this has been kind of range bound. Uh, the target would be again near these highs. Uh, if we start to roll over in the indices, you would want to keep stops, trail them, uh, maybe move them up below the 50% retracement, and then the 618, and then uh, trail it below the 15. So let's go over to the options chains. You can see the March contract uh, with about 52 days till expiration. The 160, 155s, again, if you recall, this is where our uh, risk point is, 160 area. So I'd look to maybe sell. The 160s uh, gives us about seven and a half bucks or so out of the money. The midpoint here on the marches are about 140. So if you get 140, 150, that'd be a good trade. Uh, going lower, take you five dollars further out of the money, it gives you 80 cents or so, 80 cents credit. Um, now you will have earnings um, to, to get through if you do the March contracts. Looking over at the Febs with about 24 days till expiration. Uh, you've got the 160, 155s going for 50 cents. Uh, the 165, 160 is a little bit more aggressive at a dollar. Um, let's see what this has done in past earnings. You can see uh, here 152 to 162, 163. It's about a $10 move. Going back here, we've had uh, 135 up to 147, so about $12. So this thing can move. And that is a reason I do not want to hold this thing at earnings, especially with a $5 wide uh, spread. But that should give you some ideas um, to play around with. Again, uh, you can see 10 over the last 10 years have been positive. 
average gain of 13.2%, no drawdown, and a cumulative gain, gain over those 10 years of 59%. So let's see if we can make it 11 for 11. Until next time, we'll see you then. All right, I would like to remind you that Trade Thirsty has their upcoming three-man market mastermind this Saturday, January 28th from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. Eastern. Be sure to register at the link above. This session will be geared specifically towards uh, options traders, but uh, keep in mind you can also uh, trade stocks and other instruments. But we've got three professional options traders Beginning the session with Todd Gordon from TradingAnalysis.com, selecting the ideal strike in options, followed by Sarah Potter from SheCanTrade.com, extra weekly income generating trades for the options trader, and then last but not least, Mr. Stephen Place, who I think is a first uh, on the Trade Thirsty circuit, from InvestingWithOptions.com, and he'll be sharing strategies on how to earn $500 to $1,000 per week with no added risk, less stress, and more freedom. So uh, join the link above, Three Man Market Mastermind, this Saturday, January 28th, 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. Eastern, and we hope to see you there.